Intercontinental Exchange Incorporated, New York Stock Exchange ICE, trades at $66.24 having a market capitalization of $39.06 billion. ICE stock price climbed 22.91% over the past year, yielding a positive weighted alpha of 21.3%. Since an alpha above one hints at more gains, investors can predict some further rally scope. Weighted alpha is used to calculate how much a share has gone up or down over a certain period, normally a year. In general, more thrust is placed on most recent actions by assigning higher weights to it than those assigned to past movements. This assists to give a return figure that has a stronger focus on the most current period and is thus a better measure for short-term analysis. This technique is highly famous among technical analysts. If the stock is up it will have a positively weighted alpha. If the stock price is unchanged its weighted alpha will be smaller. A stock price loss will yield a negatively weighted alpha. Intercontinental Exchange Incorporated, New York Stock Exchange ICE, Technical Metrics Support is likely to come between $65.44 a share to $64.65 a share level. However, if the ICE shares go below $64.65 then it would indicate a much weaker market for the company. In that case, its shares would mark a 2.4% decline from the most recent price. The typical day in the last two weeks has seen about a 1.88% volatility. The average volume for Intercontinental Exchange Incorporated, New York Stock Exchange ICE, has been 2.61 million shares per day over the past 30 days. ICE has a one-week performance of 1.16%. ICE price is down nearly minus 7.55% from its 52-week high price of $71.24 a share but is up about 19.63% from its 52-week low price of $53.24 a share. Activision Blizzard Inc., Nasdaq at V, has accumulated 1.16% over the course of one week. It seems that Activision Blizzard Inc., Nasdaq at V, might see strength given an ABR of 2 or by rating. Analysts, on average, seem bullish as they suggest that V is worth $6.84 more, giving a target price of $70.04 a share. ICE share have rallied by 17.41% in percentage terms since the start of the year, and retreated minus 6.65% in the last month. Volume in the last session has decreased compared with ICE's average trading volume. We think the decreased volume is representative of sellers as it is displayed in many other cases. Activision Blizzard Inc., NASDAQ at V, pullback coming soon. At V Stochastic Oscillator, percent %D, is at 82.52%. Values of percent %D line that are above 80 indicate that the security is overbought, prices could well fall in the near future, and the values below 20 that it is oversold, indicate prices could very well bounce upwards. The stochastic oscillator is a powerful technical tool that is somewhat surprisingly easy to understand. In a basic sense, it is used by technicians to measure the speed or momentum of the price movement. It represents the location of the previous close relative to the price range over a set number of periods. This can be more easily understood, however, by pulling apart the two lines on the stochastic oscillator and explaining the simple underlying mathematical formulas. The first line is called the percent %K line, which analyzes the actual price movements in the shares and can be defined as percent %K equals current close, lowest low, highest high, lowest low, 100. The second line the percent %D line is simple a 3-day moving average of the percent %K line. There are three primary ways to read the stochastic oscillator in search of entry points, but traders should follow the percent %D line closely because that indicates major trends on the chart. Activision Blizzard Inc., NASDAQ at V, Critical Levels Activision Blizzard Inc., NASDAQ at V Test latest quote $63.2 minus $2.43 minus 3.44% will find technical support and $61.2 a share, 
and a breakdown below this region would be a significantly bearish signal for Activision Blizzard Incorporated traders. Any way you dice it, a dip below $59.19 a share would be very bad news for Advi's technical picture in the near term. The $59.19 level represents at least another 6.34% downside for the stock from its current price. If Activision Blizzard Inc. NASDAQ at V, shares can stay above the price resistance around $66.12 a share, that could help propel Activision Blizzard Inc. NASDAQ at V, higher to the next line of resistance at $69.03 a share. The typical day in the last one month has seen about a 2.27% volatility. ATV is down around 44.43% from its 12-month high of $35.12 notched on December 2, 2016, but is minus 12.72% above its highest point the past 12 months of $71.24 a share.